just need to get out of here. Right? So I'm going to read if it's available. I'm going to read my horoscope, which says Russia Grant Copyright Daily Express. You feel a workmate who is trying to speak out for themselves is being misunderstood. Have a private word with them to make sure you are reading them correctly before saying something on their behalf. And all I'm going to say to that is all that I have here, Facebook memories, will be my story because this is about me. And why I'm fighting not to let depression turn me over. The things they say. The good man is the friend of all living things. Mahatma Gandhi, 1869 to 1948. And I'm going to start off with this. I saw this in the paper when I went to Peckham Hub. Yeah. So now I'm going to make use of all these things. So the pervert who keeps popping up, keep popping up because you're going to know and hear about yourself. I'm going to start off with this. Yeah. I haven't worked in seven years. The dental problems that I have. And it all started when I had to extract tooth, a teeth, tooth, 2014, when I transferred to bird in the bush and how it all started. So I went to my garden because I, I need to finish here and go back out there. It's called therapy. Because if I don't do that, I'm just going to be in big trouble. So... Let me give you some background to who is Marvelee Myers. He has taken in my indoor plants. So Marvelee Myers was born late 50s, town Edward Smallland, Jamaica. Sixth surviving child, child children of Pearlene Louise Nemhard and Ivan Sandiman Nemhard. I have I had um, five older brothers, two of whom have died, and two younger brothers. And I've been a carer from the time my youngest brother was born. I moved to where we have our own land, 1963, coming up Christmas time, before just before Christmas time. And from thence, I guess the love of nature this big land property that we had, Phantom Park before us, just made me who I am, a nature-loving person. And I remember now some of the things that happened to me then. First thing was, first day I moved there, I fell down, hit my head on a stone protruding out of the road, out of the ground. And decided there's nobody else here, so I better pick myself up and go back home. And I've been picking myself up ever since. Another incident I can remember that caused me not to eat certain food. I'll cook it, but I don't eat it. That's the power of whatever. So I'd cook something in a tin. Back then, little young. And it scratched me. The explanation was when it's dug up, it needs to be drained first before it's cooked. I didn't know that. And that's why I guess I was such a good person in terms of my working with young children. EYFS coordinator, Senko, multi-generational working approach facilitator, and why I think children gravitate towards me because they identify themselves in me. The ring that my father had to cut off of my finger. So it was popcorn ring twisted on it that I have to cut it off. I could go on and on and on why I guess these little things became part of who I am. And I guess in a sense, 
it's empowering because I'm always making sure I take back control and manage whatever was happening to me. So for what Leaf has done to me, I'm not going to accept it. And that's why I'm going all out now and naming those. Let them come and prove themselves that they are not who my man, mind said for my research and the evidence. They are not who they say they are. Juna Sullivan, a pervert, wants to be remembered as a disruptive influence. And recently, Richard Harty, who came, phoned me, threatened me. Hence, I had to go and research him. And on his profile, men in child care, a voice of a child research. So I started at Westminster Children's Society. That's who I signed contract with. Done the interview and everything by the May. But I was going home for my family reunion. I'd planned it over the time. So I decided I'm going to start the job when I get back. So I actually got back, started the job the 1st of September. Fitzrovia Community uh, Nursery. It's in the papers. So Leaf couldn't challenge them, so they decided to take me on. At the interview, interview, I told them that I could only accept the job if I'm going to be um, given a job working with over two because of my disabilities. That was the agreement. But when I turned up at Fitzrovia Community Nurse, so it was a different thing. I already a graduate of Open University. Yeah, but I was treated more or less like, I don't know, who they are, who Leaf has turned out to be. So after everything was said and done, the discrimination started. I was advised, of course, to do mentoring and all the whole works. I'd done the training and everything. Only for Maria Goncalves was doing her foundation degree to take, to take a set on me. So me being me, I have to have things out in the open. I wrote, when she wouldn't listen, I put it in writing. And that was the start of Leaf targeting me, meeting with Maria um, aging and everything. And I remember the name. And so they came for meeting. So as a result, when I was at Fitzrovia, one day this young lady came. She recognized me. I didn't recognize her. So I'm saying I don't change much. Apart from the hair green and whatever, I don't change much. Yeah, I, I saw a picture of me at the wedding where my face is showing. I'm changed much. So as a result, this young lady, when who recognized me, spoke up for me, and I was transferred to Luton Street Community Nursing from where I was empowered. Publishing the done the a voice of a child research for Juno Sullivan, August 2010. Publishing the nursery world, done other jobs throughout consultation, whatever, whatever. They're all in this folder. If I need the evidence. Yeah? So I'm just going to show you some of what I have in this folder because I need to be decluttering and getting rid of all these things that's causing be part of my thing. So here it says, Professional Development Plan, and it's E215 Professional Development Plan. So that would be for my studies with the Open University. I keep certain things. Um, I don't have access because they were typewritten. I have the, it was a USB disk, and I have them. If anybody can help me to transfer them, I would be grateful because maybe they could help towards my book. So here it is. I just feel like crying. RL 
RLO Recording Form B2, supporting foundation stage children in mathematical development and knowledge and understanding of the world. Yeah, I've never passed a math, math exam in my life. I know I was this calculator. And since I've done um, dyslexia training, I realize I have all the five traits associated with dyslexia. So here are some, I think, things that I, I, I collected over the years. I have my mindset on becoming a teacher. So it said learning mentors, teachers, whatever, whatever. Job description, teaching assistants. So I keep these. In time, I'm just going to get rid of them because they're becoming part of the whatever. Because when I, when I looked at the missed opportunities because of discrimination. Yeah. So there they are. Soon I'm getting rid of them. Yeah, so as you can see, it says HCT group. That's a, I done my whatever, and I was advised to do volunteering so I could get on the teacher training program. Didn't happen. Yeah, when I contacted David Cameron, Prime Minister, and was contacted by the Department for Education. So, yeah, so I was advised to change. So I have an appointment booked with National Careers Youth Service Advisor. I didn't just sit here and hope that things going to... I went all out, and that's why LEAF is not going to get away. University of East London pedophile Richard Hart is not going away, and, and, and whoever. Yeah? So let's see what's happening out of this. Oh, fuck. Yeah, so see, part of that. Right, so see something I prepared? It says, teaching assistant teacher trainers, trainings, shadowing tutor Daniel Williams. Yeah? NVQ level two certificate in supporting teaching and learning in schools. Yeah, to where I'm at now and what they have also done, abandoned. But if my very own can abandon me, why should I have problems with total strangers? Yeah, evaluation form. So maybe I do another one and then I just get rid of all these because they're becoming part of the triggers for my trauma. So there it is, schools as organization. As I said, I need to get rid of these things as soon as possible. So it's an assessment plan, as you can see, it's all there. So more than likely, I might have these on sticks type up, I don't know. Or maybe it's what I have to handwrite. So see, HCT group. Yeah, different types of schools.
the step in our walking reflex. I'm sure Daniel gave me that handout. Early communication and language. Early communication and language. Monitoring aid. Send, yes, no, whatever, whatever. Yeah? So this would be to do with probably me being the Senko at least. HCT group. Recognizing abuse. Recognizing abuse. And after all the abuse reviews online, I am the criminal who needs emotional regulation treatment. Yeah? So that is what I, whatever. Yeah. So here it says motor skills. So I, I take I have handout of my thing, but I'm gonna show you. And from I was advised at Lambert College to use my assignments for my first book. So this is what I drafted. This is what I drafted. Yeah, for my for, for my thing. My book all about me, because this is what I draw. Yeah. That's the next page. That's the next page. Did I make this book? I doubt it very much. Or maybe I did. I don't know. I don't remember. Here it is. <laughs> So these are templates that I made, people. Yeah? So more than likely, this would have been done at Luton Street. Something I was planning because this is the name of the stu the children, yeah. So poor than likely this was done at Luton Street. Uh, an idea whenever I have an idea. So I'll tell you the names of the children. All right, I'll do the yes. It says Bookless, Mervilly, Sarah, Casper, Ishi, plus two. So Ishi's mother was the lady who told me that. I could um you because of the way I done the learning journey, I could write people's story. Edla, Abdullah, Maha, Ta Tiana, Yasmin. I can I'm looking at some of these children now. Ashmita, Stephen, Osman, Sophia, Andrea. Andrea is a, a, a boy. Clement. I have a picture on there. Andrea made the from the cardboard, he made the cross and then he lied down on it. And here I am today, a criminal. Activity planning, my book about me. CL, communication and language. Speaking, page 21, builds up vocabulary that reflects the breadth of their experiences. And I put um, arrow. 30 to 50 months, personal PSE, self-confidence and self-awareness, page 12, 30 to 50. I'm a criminal, needing emotional regulation treatment. 30 to 50 months, welcomes plus values, praise for what they have done. I'm a criminal, needing emotional regulation. UW, 
People and Communities, page 39, 30 to 50 months, remembers and talks about significant events in their own experience. And my LinkedIn account stolen, Twitter account stolen, locked out of Facebook for how many days? Each time they do that to make me voiceless. Liter lit literacy, writing, page 32, 30 to 50 months, sometimes gives meaning to marks as they draw and paint. Me, myself, and I, they are unique individual. Make a book. There are similarities and differences in all of us. Making a book, book template, more about support and guide and prompt, less able one-to-one -one support. Use knowledge and expertise from studies to make a book template to my children ages and stages of development slash learning. Encourage children to join in by giving them choice to consultations. Extend name tags. 13th of the 3rd, 2014, my identity, my name. And that's what I have on here. I live with my, and this is the outline of my book, so I'm sure it's from Luton Street. And here I am, a criminal. Need an emotional regulation treatment. Does anybody know what this has done to me? Yeah. Beaten up by police. Police sent to section me on the malicious report from Winston Duncan after he stole my manuscript. Police came back again on the cover of the Margaret Town lecture last year and beat me up. And then they said I was tensing up, so they had to protect three officers. And then what happened to me at Walworth Police Station? Yeah? 1998. Theories of development. That's from Lambeth College. Or another handout, recognizing abuse. And now I am the one who needs emotional regulation treatment after my stories are online and my account stolen. Yeah? <laughs> yeah? So this is about UNICEF. UNICEF report on childhood in industrialized countries. London, 14 February 2007. A new report providing valuable insight into the well being of children in 21 industrialized countries is released today by UNICEF. So, why am I going to sit here and let them take away 29 years of my life? I'm the mother of Kevin Murray and Valdin Legister. The grandmother of five grandchildren. And after the death of my mother, when I discovered my mother's story just the January and she died the June, I must allow them to do what they've done to me and get away with it. And Juno Sullivan parading Margaret Horn lecture and those people involved, are they not aware of the abuse reviews online? Duchess Kate at Stockwell, with Oshana, Oshana, who they use allegation to destroy. So Oshana is working on the modern slavery. So yes, now he's deputy manager. Maybe groom him to become another of um, Richard Hart's pedophile men in childcare. Yeah? So this is the whole document. So I'm going to put that away now. Does anybody know what I'm going to? The palpitations, all that I'm going to. Seven plus years of hell. 
And I'm now a criminal. For pedophiles to get away with what they're getting away. I got Sarah last now of the thing I'm, I'm bundled now with Dooley. For my ethnicity. But what difference has she made? And maybe Tanya is thinking, oh, what she's going to do for me? No, you ain't doing anything for me, Tanya. Ain't. Because you published my poem, you didn't even put a little caption. And you're sending me about well-being, this and Zoom and storytelling. I don't need anybody to whatever. And then you're going to restrict me to what I can say or what I can't say. No, I don't need it. Yeah? So I'm just going to show you, because I said I published in the Nursery World show, in the Nursery World magazine, 2011, July 2011. And... On the Margaret Horn lecture I hear, Juno Sullivan, or the parents, mother, whatever, all oh, children didn't know this. And, and I was the one who, uh, it's there. When I, I done the project, I used the whole curriculum. I had to teach parents and children where the potato came from. And I done the whole thing from using it as activity, planting it, reaping it to be published. And today I am here criminal and is it any wonder I feel the way I'm feeling because when I eat one day I don't know when again my stomach is going to take food I will develop an eating disorder There's uh, the teeth in my head they're no good and so even eating when I can eat it's become a chore it's so painful so I experimented and I got this for the first time. My husband got big pumpkin, but for me, this is the first time. I experimented and these are my pumpkin. So what I'm going to do this year, I'm going to plant from very early to see the result. I have chocho out there going. Yeah? As you can see, this is withered, but I, I, I reap it to, to do this, to do the recording to show you who I am. And I have to finish this and go out and get fresh air because my stomach is constricting. Yeah? And even this little one, I'm telling story. My stomach is constricting, so if I can do this, yeah, it's going to be another feather in my cap. And that's going to show the pedophiles yeah that panicking richard harty who called and threatened me and take me off the course at the university of east london he's done his investigation what investigation have you done richard harty pedophile richard harty what investigation have you done produce that report yeah or you're gonna get strung up by your balls richard harty and i might recommend that you get castrated richard harty yeah this is when they started stitching me up about dress code and footwear and whatever here it is yeah Fifteenth of September, twenty fifteen, meeting at New Cross. <sighs> yeah, and since I found something, I'm gonna do this again, whatever. Yeah, so I show this how I've been stitched up in this country. Here it is, me having to write to King's College Hospital. After the first miscarriage of justice, after the death of my brother, my address, 2010, 22nd of the 2nd, 2010, King's College Hospital NHS Foundation Trust, to whom it may concern, despite receiving a payslip dated 21st of the 1st, 10, stating the amount of 214 pounds, 1p would have been paid by check to the Today, 22nd of the 10, 22nd of the 2nd, 2010, I am still waiting to collect 
the check for the amount. I would be grateful if you could look into the matter and let me have the money as soon as possible. Regards, Marvely Myers. In 24, in 2004, I was in this. I begged the South London Press to publish my story. And I had to go through the financial ombudsman to get my money, to get compensation. And in 2021, I take my money into Barclays Bank to deposit money to help with my daughter-in-law university fee. And I stood at the bank, I stood at the counter and I was scammed a thousand pounds in Barclays, Tower Bridge Road. Because I was due in university at the next day and all that I had to do, going to the GP, whatever, whatever, all caused by discrimination. So I said to them, I was stressed. Uh, uh, they deliberately didn't put the transaction through because they had their plan. So I came home. They sent me home to get verification. And next time I went back, they scammed me. They said I only... Luckily, I'm the sort of a person, so I'm asking questions. Else it would have gone through. And whilst I'm there, they call police on me. Close, lock me in their, their branch. A person with my whatever. But I learned not to get physical. Do you see the pattern? My brother died in prison because of provocation. And he went to church and wait for the police. And when the police came, it's only because I knew my rights. Yeah? And this, whilst I was waiting, they were there expecting me, whatever. They closed my, they, they sent a right letter to close my account. The account isn't closed. So let's see what the financial, uh, financial ombudsman is doing. So I'll do this in another one. I'm just doing this because I need to tie up certain things. So I'm going to do whatever I need to do and just chuck out what I need to chuck out because they are becoming part. Yeah? Nursery practical examples required for a book. This is for many Conkim, whatever her name is. Yeah? Chapter 2, Ross U. Chapter 3, Four Bell. Chapter 4, The Mil Macmillan Sisters. Chapter 5, PRJ. Yeah. So here I have some things. So I'm going to put all these into context. So this is something to do with smart. What is an IEP? So I have these. So this is what I read from Andrea Barnes. So I'm going to do this as a podcast or whatever. All these fold and just get rid of this because they be coming. Yeah. So see things there. I'm not going to go any further with this because I can feel this, whatever. Yeah? Or maybe I continue until. Yeah? I have something that senior early years practitioner. They said they have no data for me. I use subject access request. Yeah? Record of outcome for job eva uh, evaluations. So I just keep on on here. Yeah? This is me. I'm always thinking about ways. So this is the whatever activity. Who has the hat? So this would be 2014 at a Bird in the Bush. I never get any of these projects off, off the ground. Yeah? Early years training. I'm always attending training. Yeah? So as you can see, 2015. Now, that would be at Luton Street. That would be at New Cross. Yeah? Now, like when I was at um, Luton Street, Michelle, who I mentored, me with a foundation, she was the one doing each one to each one, and then I do the work and they get the accolade. Well, it was the same thing with Flavia. Yeah? And she escaped. Yeah? Yeah? So here is something I wrote. 
and I'm going to read it. Children's Behavior, June 22nd, 2011. Adults' Inconsistency. I am the one now who needs emotional regulation treatment, isn't it? The children in particular are responding to the way adults interact with them, each, with, with each other, and play on that. This morning, Eric was acting up, and I asked him to leave the group for a few minutes. Julie confronts the adult and keeps going on about the matter. Told her I am doing, I'm dealing with it. PM, Eric was once more disruptive after being spoken to by the same adult. I put in back it, me, Mary, and Tanya. <laughs> Reflections. I do not have a problem about Julie intervening, but I believe the way she the way she chooses to intervene is giving the children mixed messages and causing them to see how much they can get away with. Conflicts and tensions. <laughs> I feel undermined, devalued, and demoralized when my practice is being questioned and I have to justify myself in front of the children and colleagues. I am a criminal needing emotional regulation treatment. Yeah? So this would be the exit questionnaire that I was supposed to do when I'm doing the research of voice of a child for Juno Sullivan. So this is a routine for Luton Street. So I'm going to get all these up and whatever and then just get rid of the whole thing. Yeah? So I'm going to read this one as well. Because these are going to be done folder by folder and chop them out. March 15, 2013, Incident Resafe Garden. Slash behavior. I was standing by the gazebo when I see an incident building up over in the garden. Garden patch at the end of, at the far end. Puts me in mind of why, how the security officer had to rescue me at the University of East London. This is going to be made into whatever and just chuck out. So I'm getting my head around. I'm working. As soon as I get my new laptop, then I will have my videos to tie in with whatever. The parent who is with the children in the vegetable patch can be seen talking to one of the children. So I called the child to come over and he did. When he comes over, he kept saying, but I want to, dot, 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 repeatedly. The parent comes over and said he was going to kill a worm. The child keeps saying, but I want to, dot, dot, dot. The parent said, why would he want to kill a worm? I diffused the situation and the parents walk away. Yeah, a security officer had to come out to diffuse a situation at the University of East London. I turned back to the child in a calm manner and asked him why he did not listen to the adult. And, he's, and he repeated, but I want to. I asked him if he would like someone to kill him, like how he wants to kill the worm. He said, no. I asked him if he was feeling okay or wants to go inside. He said, no. I asked him if he wants to go and play and needs the rocket I had taken from him. I turn to walk away and the child walks over to the bricks on the ground, grabs one, is about to hurl it, dot, dot, dot. I reacted immediately and got hold of the brick and sent him inside. Yeah? 2013. And now I am the one who needs emotional regulation treatment. Here's another one. And then I'm going to wrap this up. Yeah? So I'm going to use this. Yeah? As a podcast about behavior, how I manage behavior. And show the world... That Marvely Myers does not need emotional regulation treatment. It's the career criminals and protectors of paedophiles at the Judiciary of England and Wales, the Crown Prosecution Service, and the criminal justice system that needs it, not me. 
yeah so i'm not gonna go any further with this one this is gonna be now as of now a daily and get rid of these folders because they as i said i didn't even i'm not even conversant of some of the things that i have yeah but i'm gonna put them now together yeah yeah how oh, i was treated i'm doing the work yeah so these will be my thingy now i will no longer let depression take me over i know what my limit is when it's time to go get fresh air and start back my life i have my camcorder no i have my camera i'll be doing all this good manners Three little words we all should know. They are good morning, please, and thank you. Use them quite often whenever you go. There are no nicer words than these. Yeah? So I keep things. Did I ever get any of these projects off the ground? Only what um, they stole from me. So I'm, now it's my time. So this is how I'm doing in emotional regulation treatment. I ain't meeting up with them because I don't want to go punch nobody or whatever. I'll stay here and do my emotional regulation treatment with whatever I need to do. Right, I'm gonna read this one and 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 wrap up and maybe I should use it for my therapy session because the therapists give me homework. Friday, twenty first, twenty fourteen. Was thinking last night about record reasons why I react to certain situations because of my experiences over the years. Dot, dot, dot. Got into work this morning and have another real life realization. Started with SB talking about roles and responsibilities, read behavior management. <sighs> Clarified my position about when I was given the role. Wednesday slash Ofsted. Yeah, Ofsted came. I'm sure I was the one left to face Ofsted. Said it took four years for this to happen, as I've been talking about it ever since I got here, and it is welfare requirement. SB talking about writing down what I know so everyone else to follow. Yeah, she had a motive. No, it's the no, it is the organization's job since this was discussed at high level meeting. No more was to come when I no more was to come when when I am being questioned about the difference between health and safety and safeguarding. So everybody used me as sounding board. She was going to do a interview somewhere else. She left leave. And she got in back to leave because I guess to her, leave was better than where she went. Yeah? So it's out there. She has interview lined up. So she has to do research. So now I know why my brain is being picked. So another bastard can use my knowledge and expertise to climb up the career ladder. But I but I sure as hell will not allow that to happen over my dead body. So I plan my potato planting activity and told everyone about my intentions. Only one person to come out. Only one person and told only one person to come out, come ask. I thought in bracket they the children were taking part. I I just turned my head and one look. Asked Madonna at lunch break if she heard what was being said by SB. Yeah, so these are my record. Yeah, see, I have something here children's schema, circuit time, whatever. I plan on doing a book about schema. 
So I'm going to end this one here, people, and all these folders. Yeah? Will be made into a Facebook memory. No, I'm not doing Facebook these. I won't tolerate what Facebook is doing to me. So I'll be using my platforms. Yeah? Thursday, 8 of the eight, Thursday, 8 of the 8, 13. Yeah? So I have everything right down. See? And written. So I'm going to use these now. Wednesday, September 18, 2013. A day in the life of Luton Street Community Nursery. Yeah? Here it is. Now is my time. I'll stay right in here and do emotional regulation treatment. So the world knows the pedophiles. How Ofsted turn a blind eye. How Juno Sullivan can have people, uh, Margaret Horn lecture and talking crap. Yeah? Here's more thingy. So now I forget about whatever. Yeah? Leave 12 steps into involving parents. So more than likely I'd be doing all this. You just put it together and Mervyn Lee Myers does the work and they take control. Yeah? Here is stars and whatever, so it's for my activity. Yeah? And at the end, so I'm just going to finish this, go outside and get some fresh air and continue with my life and close down this thing. Yeah? So this is when uh, whatever, I, I started making notes because I have the, the, the letter about Mervilly, my e whatever, whatever, uh, monthly reports or weekly reports. So I'm going to end this one here. Did I show my pumpkin? Yes. I'm ending this one here for why I have been put through this hell to facilitate pedophiles and perverts and Jonah Sullivan, a psychopath. Better days are coming. By and by. When we reach the city in the sky, sorrow will be over and joy will come at last. Better days are coming by and by. Better days are coming by and by when we reach the city in the sky. Sorrow will be over and joy will come at last. Better days are coming. Bye. Bye. Jesus alone can I bear the crucified cross. And all the world will go free, see how they nailed him, nailed him there, see how they nailed him, nailed him there. <laughs> Jesus alone cannot bear 
And all the world go free and strike our and W came foot M strike our and W came foot M strike our and W came out. So a Moses strike the rock and the water came out. M strike our and W came out. Why is Facebook sending email to me about Sydney Post photo and whatever? When Facebook has restricted my rights, yeah? Why is Facebook doing that? Why is Facebook provoking me, cluttering up my email about Sydney Post, whatever, when you're restricting my rights to use my pages, to have a voice, Facebook? Isn't that cyberbullying? Isn't that terrorism? M strike car and W came out. So a Moses strike the rock and the water came out. Two roads before you pick your choice. Two roads before you. Pick your choice. Two roads before you. Pick your choice. There is hell and there is heaven. Pick your choice. Two roads before you. Pick your choice. Two roads before you. Pick your choice. Two roads before you. Pick your choice. There is hell and there is heaven. Where is it? I don't fucking know where it is. Pick your choice. Two roads before you. Pick your choice. Two roads before you. 